Well, let's get back to the earlier story we told you about the national legal advisor of the All Progressive Congress that his constituents are planning his expulsion. A lot of story uh, regarding the crisis rocking the party in Lagos State. We have now the national legal advisor of the APC, Senior Advocate of Nigeria, Mr. Moise Banire, joins us by telephone on the program. Many thanks for coming on the program tonight, Mr. Banire. Uh, there, I mean, some of your constituents, some of the members of your party are planning your expulsion. And, uh, We've heard once from the, uh, from the party at the national level that they cannot do that. But what exactly is the state of things? You did not show up at the disciplinary committee uh, hearing where you were supposed to uh, state your own side of the story earlier today. Well, in the first instance, let me just tell you that uh, there's no... Hello, can you hear me? Yeah, please go ahead. Yes, as I'm talking to you, no... Uh, the disciplinary committee has been put in place by any legitimate group. Uh, of course, it is called a continuous show of shame by those people that claim to be party members, but unfortunately, they do not even know the color of the position of APC, so much like the content. Uh, like United said, a lack of necessary capacity in the first instance or even someone may leave at all, assuming that they are members of APC. But if you have seen the publication today by the authentic leaders of APC in Mochilo government, you will see that these are strangers. These are political jobbers that are put together for a purpose. Unfortunately, they are just wasting the people's resources in this regard. This is not the first one. They have just recently paid in compromising the national officers of the party. That's why they resulted to this rampage again. Uh, the it... matter has been nailed last week or two weeks ago by the national, that certainly by our constitution, because the national officer of the party is responsible for that in this case, and because that control does not even provide for the discipline of a national officer at that level, certainly you have no capacity to do it. All right. Before before I allow you go, uh, Mr. Banura, if I may quickly uh, uh, ask you this, uh, it has been said on the street there in Lagos, so the APC will say that you are falling out with uh, your leader, Ashwa Jutinubu, that that's the reason why your expulsion issue is coming up. Have you, are you willing to, to beg your way out of this expulsion move? Unfortunately, the earlier the better, all of them realize the fact that I'm going to be in that office in the end of my tenure, the better for them because I say no to impunity and impunity will stop. That's number one. Number two, I have no problem whatsoever. I'm not calling out to anybody, much less actually particularly. As far as I'm concerned, actually is a leader, I have no issue with him. But those people who certainly are not for the rule of law can never be my friend. I am for the rule of law. It's as simple as that. And I tell you for free, if you are comfortable with the APC constitution, which I can even apply, if you not even know anything about it, you cannot even expel anybody. Not even the national body can expel a member of the party. It's only the national convention that right. eventually even expel anybody. So they don't want to even understand. That is further confirms to you that these are strangers to the party. All right. Mm. Mr. Banure, many thanks, uh, Senior Advocate of Nigeria and the National Legal Advisor of the APC. Many thanks for your thoughts tonight on the program.